Hey guys, welcome to the property tour. This one is a two bedroom apartment in Birmingham City Centre. And this is one of my properties that I've had quite a few years. I believe this is three years old. Let me give you a tour and show you around. And this is a two bedroom. It's a penthouse apartment. It's really, really good actually. When we took it on, it looks nothing like this. So bear in mind, we have done a little refurb job on it. I'll start off with the living room first because we're here and I'll show you the rest of the rooms. And again, being a two bed, it does generate really good cash flow. And again, this is on a rent to rent basis. We don't, I don't, I haven't bought this, I don't own it, it's a rent to rent. So uh, we'll start off with the kitchen. Uh, now, nothing really was done here because it's just a bog standard kitchen. Obviously it's fully equipped, got all the essentials that you would need that you would normally find in a service department, service house. Let's go to the other side of the living room. Now this side I really love, so I've called this the Lamborghini themed apartment. When we took it on, obviously the theme was to go for like a yellow and then blue and gold, that sort of a luxury feel. Um, the sofa is really, really good, really comfy. I believe I got this from these Facebook sellers. Uh, this was about 350 and it's lasted quite a long time. This is really, really good. So if you're looking for deals and bargains, don't be afraid to not use Facebook. I literally typed in uh, luxury blue velvet sofa and it came really, really good to be fair. Of course, if you do spend like another eight, 900 quid, you can get the ones from Wayfair, but they're very expensive. So for this, it's really, really good. The wallpaper is actually Lamborghini itself. It is real Lamborghini wallpaper. Um, I'm trying to show you where you can see, but on the pattern, it actually says Lamborghini embroidered on it. Let me try and find one. See that? On every little square, there's like a Lamborghini. So. This is actually real Lamborghini wallpaper, <laughs> which is quite cool. Again, we've got a smart TV, 50, 50 inch Samsung smart TV, um, bits of gold accents and then a nice blue rock here on the floor. Let me show you the bedrooms and that's where I really think my creative skills came to light. So we'll start off with bedroom one. Again, this is a hallway. Quickly, just before I do go into the bedroom, Lamborghini ball art, bosh. This was from Etsy. Uh, it was quite expensive, but I think, I think this was around 120. I can't remember, or I believe it was 89 quid. It was one of them too, but it was really worth the investment and purchase. Quick show of the hallway, just got a little mirror here, which is really good. So when you're literally leaving or entering, at least you can see yourself, which is really good for guests. And um, again, these basically, why I bought these. I think when, when I was building the business, uh, I had quite a few of these prints left over from previous properties. So what I chose to do is just stick it in here and um, they look really good. And these have been on here for, since the property went live, which is quite a long time. So it's hanging on a nail on a hook and then a double-sided tape and going on there, as you can see, like I'm pushing it, they're not falling. Unlike this one, oh, this one I've done, I've done it to as well. But if you look at the mirror, um, this is loose because I haven't uh, put sticky, double-sided sticky tape. So. Maybe that's a little tip for you guys, which is if you're gonna put hang pieces of art or mirrors or whatever, add that sticky tape so it doesn't fall off. And let me show you bedroom one. Bedroom one, I literally love like the wallpaper. We followed it through, which is a Lamborghini wallpaper across this side as well. The wall art. Now, I chose to carry on this sort of arty sort of dock sort of theme and the money theme everywhere. So you've got that there, and then behind you've got the Rolex prints. Uh, no one's actually stolen these, which is really, really cool. They're still on the wall, which is absolutely amazing. And again, I've got my signature company name and branding on the wall, which is a 3D plastic material, which is just stuck, stuck, stuck on. And you've got the branded pillows with my company branding and logo on it. Now this room obviously does feature a smart TV on the wall, which is really good. So guests can watch Netflix in bed. Now let me show you bedroom two. So bedroom two, uh, similar sort of style. Let me just remove my coat hanger that I put on there. So bedroom two has a similar sort of style and features bedroom one. So again, you've got the Lamborghini sort of accents going around, the exact same Lamborghini wallpaper. And then you've got a piece of art. Now, if you've watched The Wolf of Wall Street, you know exactly what I'm talking about. So this is a moment where he steps out of the car and he's on his books and he's coked out of his head and he's trying to get into his Lamborghini. And this was, was this I thought was a really key moment in the film. So I really wanted to include that. And the color was yellow. So I was like, this is perfect because this is like a yellow themed apartment. 
behind me. So this was like a really empty dead space and I thought, what can I do with this dead space? Now, obviously this is a Lamborghini themed property and apartment, so I thought, why not put bit, bits of bobs of like the Wolf of Wall Street, the Wolf of Wall Street, which is a piece on that so you can know which part of the film that's from and then bits of bobs of uh, Lamborghini wall art a custom print there and the Rolex theme going through and obviously I'm a massive fan of, of American Express so I thought I'd include that as well and again these have been on on the wall since the start of the business and as you can see um, they are glued down as well and they haven't come off which is really really good regarding this bed these bed styles I actually absolutely love uh, they're really good, really strong and sturdy, and they haven't come off the, haven't broken. They're still really hard and fit, like really, really good. Again, this one's got a slightly bigger TV on the wall. This one's got a 40 inch TV compared to the other one, which is the 32, uh, simply because this was what we had at the time when I was setting up. You've got a sliding wardrobe mirror here, and then you've got a ensuite, which is really, really big to be fair. This is bigger than the main one. So this is the ensuite alongside bedroom two here. But then if you look at bedroom bed, bed, bedroom one, no ensuite, but then you have a bathroom in the hallway, which is just a shower. So, so I really hope you enjoyed the tour of this property. If you wanna know how much money this makes, it brings in around, I know on a slightly dry month, two and a half grand, on a really good month, it brings in like 3K, three and a half, really depends on the sort of sorts of guests and the caliber of people we get. Honestly, since putting this property live, we've had re literally a lot, a lot of long-term guests, which is really good. I think when we launched, we had loads of short stays, but since we've changed our business model, I mean, I'm trying to target longer stays. This property literally just gets filled out with long stays, which is amazing. The only reason I'm here filming now is because we've got a gap. Guys, if you want to see more videos, subscribe, send me a message, comment below. And again, if you want to get into Airbnb, send me a message on Instagram and I can help and guide you.